Today, 53 members of the First Baptist Church in Naples returned home after being in Israel as the attack started over the weekend. Wing News reporter Michelle Alvarez was there as the buses arrived from Miami International Airport. Michelle, tell us what that emotion was like as church members got off the bus. Russ, you could see the happiness on people's faces as they stepped off the bus, but you could also feel the sense of relief everyone had when they got to hug their families again. Pastor Alan Brumbach told me the group was fortunate enough to get out when they did, and they're thankful to be home. Hugs, cheers, and relief. Every moment we were afraid, we just kept trusting, we kept praying. As lead pastor Alan Brumbach of First Naples Baptist Church and roughly 50 of the church's congregation arrived home after spending five days in a nation at war with Hamas. This was an adventure, um, but we're just grateful to God because in the whole process, what, what we had with this group behind us is that you know no one really panicked. There wasn't panic because they trusted that God had had this whole thing under control. They were able to get on a plane Wednesday night and made it home safely Thursday afternoon. When we took off, we had to take a different way than we normally do to get away from the, you know, from any area. And then we got in the air, I was like, thank you, God. God, thank you so much. And uh, that's the sense of relief. Pastor Allen said it's hard to describe what the people of Israel are going through. They've had moments where missiles have come across. They've gone to through air raid drills. They've gone into bunkers and shelters, which our group got to do twice for the first time. What you're seeing in the Gaza border as you get closer to theirs is horrific. The group was there to tour some of the sites mentioned in the Bible and to connect with the Holy Land before the attacks began. My friend, when she went, she told me she was going on the tour, and I said, please find me an olive wood, hand-held cross, and I forgot I asked her, and she gets off the bus, and this, the first thing she did was give it to me. Pastor Allen says despite everything going on in the area, the trip grew them closer together as a group and closer to God. Listen, we've got a family there, you know. Um, we, we've built a bond. People were crying. That's why we had a moment. People were crying because they, we love each other. Pastor Allen said everyone is going to pray for the people of Israel on Sunday and believes this is not a religious issue, but a people issue. He said everyone in the group is a family now and that a lot of love came out of this crisis. I'm live in North Naples, Michelle Alvarez, Wink News.